Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with a one box break of 2020 Topps Inception Baseball where you can win two spots in Transcendent. Uh, and there's only a 20, 29 spots right here. There's no Cardinals. At the end of the break, we'll randomize, re-randomize all the 29 names. There'll be a different dice roll at the end. And you'll be able to win a spot in Transcendent Baseball Hall of Fame Edition break number two on coming uh, on Monday. Big thanks to these folks right here for getting into it. Good luck. No Cardinals in this set, so let's move them out. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Three and a one, four times. One, two, three, and a one. Fourth and final of the member. This is just for the break. After four times, we got Jacob, not Cobb, but we got to get the J part. Jacob down to Ryan. Four times for the teams. Fourth and final time. After four, we've got the Nats down to the Mets. Do we like Mel? Do we like Mel Kiper? Or, I, yeah, I don't. I don't mind him. I just, I'm just, as, I'm just fascinated that like a person who was never involved in like the coaching or scouting level of the NFL has risen to such a position. Like, I think it's kind of incredible. Yeah. All right, there you go. There's the first 15 right there. There's the next handful right there. There you go. Now let's alphabetize by team. So you can see Steve Birch, last Bojo, Mojo spot, still has the Rangers there. No, Derek Melanson, not a fan of the Mel Kuyper. I mean, I don't know. I mean, you know, I'm no scout. I have no idea if what he's saying is actually right or wrong. But I just think the fact that he was able to kind of, whenever he started this in the 80s or whatever, has just lasted this long, like doing these mock drafts and all that sort of stuff and how much the draft is hyped up. I mean, it's pretty, pretty brilliant. All right, there's your list right there. All right, all cards will ship out of here, too. There's Gavin Lux, Sheldon Nussi to 150. Your base cards, these are really sharp looking cards. And it's a patch auto. It's a nice one, Aristides Aquino. Woo! Three color patch and autograph. Nice RPA. One out of 10, nice low number for the Reds. Josh Melton has the Reds, wow. It's pretty strong. All right, now let's see who wins that transcendent spot. Oh, by the way, that's the next break. This is technically break number nine. You can see right up there just for clarification purposes. All right, one spot right here. So let's re-randomize your names. Eric down to Jacob. And the name on top after, it's just like break credit, new dice roll. Eight times, name on top after eight, transcendent spot. Did you not change it from the last one? I think it's I think it's always been two. Oh, right, right, right. <sighs> Come on, me. Come on, Joe. Two and a six, eight times, there's seven, once more. Top two are in transcendent two. Son of a 
I'm just losing my mind. It's always been two, right, Ryan? It's, it's always been two. Thanks, everyone, for giving this a shot. Top two. Congrats to Josh and Stephen K. You guys are in Transcendent Baseball number two on Monday. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'll see you for the next one.